Hi, my name is Robert Dean Steele, and this is Real Living. In the book of Luke, there's a wonderful story about a man who found a treasure in a field. The Bible says he, once he found it, he took everything he had, and he sold everything he had, and he bought the field, because he recognized that wonderful treasure. There was also, in that same portion of scripture, that same chapter, a wonderful story about a merchant who found a pearl of great price. The Bible says he took everything he owned, and he sold it so he could buy this pearl. Now, you say, what do those stories have to do with me? Well, you know what? There's a pearl of great price, a treasure, that God wants to share with you. And that sharing of that treasure or that pearl is the fact of His salvation. You know, salvation is a priceless gift. It, it was an expensive gift. Jesus Christ gave His life so that each one of us could have a relationship with God. It was an expensive gift, but it is offered free to all mankind. But the problem is most of us don't value this, or we haven't really thought about the value of a soul. How valuable is a soul? How valuable is a person's life? To me, life is priceless. You cannot put a price or a value on it. You can't say, well, that person is worth this month or that month. You can't say, well, your life is not worth anything. Folks, every person has value. Every person is valuable and priceless in God's sight. What we need to do is understand how valuable we are to God. In fact, we were so valuable to God that He sent the best thing He could, His Son, for us. So, today, if you're thinking that, well, I'm not really of much value, change your mind. Because you are a pearl of great price. You are a treasure in a field. My prayer is that you'll see yourself as God sees you, invaluable and priceless. And in turn, you'll turn to him and say, God, I recognize that, and I want to be that pearl of great price. My name is Robert Dean Steele. This is Real Living, and you have yourself a great day.